what's on the schedule for today? Uh, Lime Ricky, I think. Hmm. You know what goes best with Lime Ricky? No. Haikus. Really? I thought it'd be a limerick. No, haikus. Hello, and welcome to International Taste Station. I'm Sir Molly Johnson. And I'm Patrick, Patrick O'Neill. That's right, and this week we're revisiting some old ground with a good old-fashioned pop shop showdown. Uh, this week, we are doing Lime Ricky by demand. Mm. Cindy Lee asked for it. Uh. Join us, won't you? Blue terra firma before green lime ricky drink into the the moon. Ooh, that's lime ricky. I don't know what a ricky is, but that is definitely lime. Mm-hmm. Do you know what would make it even better? Alcohol. I'm very conflicted right now. I think... I think I'm going to go back to what I said about the cream soda. I'm sure this is what I said. I think I prefer the virgin version. I think I prefer the actual pop in terms of taste. This just tastes slightly too alcoholic. It is, and it seems almost flat, even though it's not flat. Um, I'm gonna go with my previous statement that they need to be mixed together. Yeah, it, it just it doesn't taste carbonated enough. Mm -mm. Like it tastes like lime flavored alcohol. Yeah. Rather than. Uh, a slightly hard lime soda. Yeah, that's perfect. Mixing the two of them makes it perfect. That actually is better, yeah. Yeah, exactly. It's almost worth it to just Mix the drink yourself, then, rather than buy the can. That's a lot better. Uh-huh. I know. It does remind me, though, Old Grainus Luna, a rock-filled vodka tango at the Old Chicken. Really? Hmm. Nearest cramp station, a little slick smitty death above the bitters. I, I couldn't agree more. It's exactly like a slick smitty death above the bitters. Mm -hmm. It's not bad, but um, yellowed urena, a little orange can, floats before the Ricky. Makes sense. I, I think you can agree. I agree. I also agree that drunken soul system, a little bleak drink orbit, out of camera. I, I, no. 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 Um. I mean, it's it's definitely bubbly. Mm. You know what it reminds me of? Mm -hmm. now, bear with me. <clears throat> it reminds me of bulbous sea deck, a raw vaulted sugar sleep at the perfect wall. Yeah, that does happen on sea deck. That's what they're known for. 
It's crazy down there. Well, first of all, and I don't care if you disagree, may I just say, Icy Soul System, an audible black pop spin after the lab coat. Oh, I totally disagree. I think it's before the lab coat. I think it's before the lab coat. Well, that's interesting, but wrong. So, like that previous comparison, I don't know that we're going to cover any new ground uh, groundbreaking ground. Um, as a drink, I think we agree the actual pop, the plain yes. virgin pop, is better. And I have the same complaints about the cream soda. There's no carbonation. No, I think that's what the problem is. It's it's flat. Yeah. The vodka. I don't know whether it's the flat. The vodka is making it flat, or they purposely make it less carbonated when they just manufacture it. I don't know, but. Well, I I think. It's barren soul system, shallow little dog, Orbit, enjoying the tent. Yes. Yes, it is. But my advice, which you can infer from what I just said, is if you want an alcoholic lime Ricky, just get some lime pop and put your spirit of choice into it. Exactly. Then you can mix it to whatever strength you want. Now, the only downside is pop shot pop. Most of their flavors are great. I'm mm -hmm. saying most because I haven't had them all. Um, you would probably have to abandon Pop Shop to do it if you wanted to have a, a lime bricky drunk on. Well, yeah, it really depends on how shit faced you want to get. Or. Or maybe if you're a cheap drunk, it would be okay. Or you buy yourself a pack of the alcoholic ones and a couple bottles of the soft just to top them off a little. Oh, that's a good idea Give as well. Give them some kick. Yep. In fact, Mandarin Thoughts, Why Airless Pop Shop Pop Dance by the Horse Stable. I don't think it's that bad. I mean, it's not like the actual pop, but it's, it's, not, the, it's not nothing to do with the horse stable. I think what you meant to say was, Jesus, my duct tape my gray duct tape, you inspired me to write How I Love the Way You Fixes and Sticks Us, Invading My Mind Day and Through the Night, Always Dreaming About the Row of Bricks. Um, this just goes on for a while. Uh, okay, who threw in a sonnet with our haikus? Bye. Let me compare you to a contender question mark. You are more sticky, glorious, and rolled. Long fogs hide the oceans of November, and autumn time has the lifelong freehold. How do I love you? Let me count the ways. I love your shiny gray and stickiness. Thinking of your prickly strength fills my days. My love for you is the wide thickness. Now I must away with a tricky heart. Remember my dull words, whilst we're apart. Watch me to rule, bitches.